and I'm sorry, but the tears yeah. are already flowing. Yeah. Al Roker is back. Yes! Come on! Uh. The forecast in New York City may call for rain, but Al Roker is bringing a ray of sunshine. The weatherman makes his emotional return to the show on January 6th, after a two-month absence from today due to health reasons. I have missed you guys so very much. You are my second family, and it's just great to be back. And wearing pants. So <laughs> it's been, uh, fun. It's so much fun. Returning to the Today studio wasn't an easy journey for the 68-year-old. In November, Al was admitted to the hospital for blood clots in his leg and lungs. Though he made it home for Thanksgiving, he was back in the hospital days later due to complications with his recovery. Check out outside, take it, Check out the plaza. Yeah, look what we got for you. A lot, your mini oh, fans. Oh, yeah. I wanted to say that is just so sweet. As much as we missed you, Al, I think the plaza missed you maybe yeah. even more. Every single day mm -hmm. we went out there, mm -hmm. signs for you, I miss well them. wishes. We, I mean, these they are your people. Yeah, yeah they my people. Yes. There you go. My people. Yeah. <laughs> Al, who appears alongside his wife and ABC News correspondent Deborah Roberts, shares details about his return to Studio 1A as well as his recent health battle. It's not lost on us that this is a major, major thing for Al to be here. He is a living, breathing miracle. Mm. He really is. And I have to say, I'm not overstating it, I don't think. Um, Al was a very, very, very sick man. And I think most people did not know that. And you all had a chance to know that. And I, Savannah's tearing up, and I'm going to be tearing up. But um, those two doctors, Dr. Felice Schnall Sussman and Dr. Jay Raman, led this brilliant team. Mm -hmm. It was a team that had to figure out what was happening. He was a medical mystery yeah. for a couple mm -hmm. of weeks. And it was the most tumultuous, frightening journey we have ever been on. Wow. As Al explains, he had, quote, two complicating things, the blood clots and internal bleeding noting that he'd lost half of the blood in his body. After trying to figure out what exactly was going on, doctors finally got their answer. And, and finally they went in, did the surgery, and it ended up you know, two bleeding ulcers, had to resection the colon, take out uh, my gallbladder, or redo wow. my duodenum. I went in for one operation, I got four free. <laughs> so, so. Al returned home from the hospital in December, and while he certainly credits his doctors for improving his health, he also gives a shout out to Deborah, his three children, and to his Today Show family and friends for their support.